Hi and welcome back. I'm Goddess McKinney and today I am going to be unboxing the Inked Goddess Creations box for the month of June. Um, so let's get started. If you hear any sounds in the background, it's either my dogs or the cat or one of my four little girls. Um, I do plan on doing a vlog maybe tomorrow just to introduce myself a little bit more to everybody. Okay, so this is what it looks like when you first open it. Oops, let's see if we can get it. This month's theme is Celtic Altar, Celtic, Celtic Altar, um, originating in Europe, Celtic magic has been practiced for thousands of years and has spread globally, and then it gives some more information, I'm not going to read it all, um, if you can see that, pause it and read it, and then here's the spoilers. I'm not going to look. I've been trying very hard not to sneak any pics. Um, I will go through the price value at the end of the video. Ooh! First things first. Wow! It looks like we've got a wooden box here and it looks like it is original to Ink Goddess Creations. There's her little symbol here. Oh, it sounds like it's got stuff inside. Okay. It looks like it's unfinished so you could stain it or draw on it or whatever you might like, paint it even. So it looks like we got a little candle here. Ooh, it smells really good. And I love this color of purple. Um, we get a candle every month about this size and they come in different colors and smells and stuff, of course. But just remember, sometimes this plastic is hard to see on the candles. But there is plastic wrapped around it, so be sure you remove that before you burn. Just a heads up. Sometimes I don't pay attention all that well, and I'm like, oops. Ooh. Cedar stick or cedar smudge wand. And then we always get um, cards. Sometimes we get a few, and sometimes we get a lot. Um, let's see, this is the Tree of Life. And this is what the back of the cards look like. And these are her own um, design and creation that she does. This one is Celtic Knots. I love Celtic Knots. Infinity! And then Celtic Goddesses. That looks fun. I know a handful of these. Um, and some Celtic Gods. And then, oh, this goes with the Cedar Smudge. I apologize for the lighting. I'm working on it. I've got one ordered and it should be here soon and the clouds are coming in and going. Um, it's supposed to rain and be windy here today. So I'm okay with that though. Um, okay, I will do this last. That's next month's spoiler. Ooh, green. I love green. Green is my favorite color. Oh, what a beautiful little bag. I love the design. 
sorry, this is Tucker. He's the newest member of our family. He is only five months old and he's a mama's boy and he's a handful. Let's see what we've got in here. Wow, we got all kinds of stuff in here. Seems like a lot this month. So here's that bag again. You could use it like a charm bag or to keep some other things in if you wanted to. A spell bag maybe or something like that. It's um, green and then it's got gold. I don't know if you can tell that this is gold designs on it. It looks like, oops, we got some fuzzies. Um, we got some Celtic resin, frankincense, myrrh, uh, and zoin or something. And some lavender. It says this brings harmony, balance, blessings, and unity. smells woodsy. I like it. I like it. And then next I'm seeing this guy here. Oh, he's got a design on the other side. But I love all the tree lines. And you can count and see how old the tree was. And then here it's got the same um, design on it as the box which is the Celtic Tree of Life, I believe. And it's surrounded by all these Celtic knots here. And you can see them all in here too, and the branches and the roots. And the branches and the roots, usually um, they connect to show infinity of life and death. Um, I know a little bit, still learning. Let's see, I'll do that last. Celtic Blessings Ritual Oil. Cleanse, anoint, and bless yourself and your sacred items. And then it's got a list of the ingredients on there, if you can see those. Um... I don't have any scissors to open this. So, can you grab some for me real quick? It's my daughter, Isabel. She's, she likes watching me do unboxings. So while she's getting that, let's move on to this. I'm excited to see what this is. And it looks like this is also an original to Ink Goddess Creations. Excuse me. It's got her her little logo or symbol down here at the bottom. Oh, how beautiful! It looks like it's a little altar cloth. And we've got some Celtic knots in the corners, moon phases in the top, and then we've got some little animals around here. And it looks like some runes on these stones. Runes for however you would like to pronounce those, along with some other plants and things. Oh, look, it's got the tree man. Can you see him right there? Sorry, I'm doing a horrible job at that. There he is. How cool is that? And that would fit perfectly like up on a wall or something like that. It's not too big, but it's just big enough. It's perfect. You got two things? Thank you, baby. Okay, well, let's check out what this smells like. I would put some on, but I already put on some Lilith oil that I also got from Inked Goddess Creations. I'll probably explain that a little more in my vlog. Um, I absolutely love her shop. I've bought so much stuff from her. Let's see here. If I can get this open, I'm having a hard time today. Doesn't smell too bad. 
It comes in this cute little little vial thing here. Which I love that. Um, her other oils usually come excuse my clutter and my altar cabinet here. But they usually come in something about this size. And this is the Lilith oil, but this is not included in this month's box. This was a separate purchase that I got. Um, and it's got like little stones and stuff in there. But back to the box. We've got one more thing. And it looks like it's a pendant. Man, today is not my day for opening things. That's for sure. Even had trouble getting my mailbox open. <laughs> oh, how beautiful. It looks like it's got some like little Celtic symbols in there. You might see my cat in just a second. He is being very curious. It's got something inside. Well, as I said, it is just not my day for opening things. You want to give it a go? So let's go over the pricing of things while my kids take turns trying to open the pendant. Um, we got the box, this guy here. And he is a $15 value. Did you get it? She got it open. Oh, it looks like... Like a lava rock, maybe? That came inside of here. Maybe for like an oil diffuser or something? Let's read and find out. Um, it says, back to the box, it says the box is 4x6 wooden box with burned Celtic tree image for you to store, alter items, personal items, jewelry, etc. Um, it's got a $15 value. And then the Celtic tree altar cloth, this guy right here. And, um, designed by Morgan, owner of Inked Goddess Creations, this beautiful altar cloth depicts a Celtic tree with entrance stones and Celtic knots. And it is a $7.50 value. Then we've got the Celtic tree altar tile, which I'm going to assume is this. This is the only thing that's kind of tile-like. Um, matching the altar box, so yes, that's this guy. This wooden altar tile can be used to charge items, display gemstones, etc. on your Celtic altar. And it has a $6, bleh, sorry, excuse me, $6 value. And I really do like this. This is going to be perfect. I can set it up over here at some point. Okay. Um, moving on. So it is a Celtic Knot Aromatherapy Necklace right here. Um, a locket with lava rock inside. So I was right. To hold and dis diffuse spell oil so I was right with that um, charge on your altar and wear to carry Celtic energy with you all day and this has um, a $15 value sorry if I say he a lot or refer to items as he a lot that's just what I do so Anyways, excuse the children in the background. They are excited to go to grandma's today. 
Then we've got the Celtic Phil candle here. This beautiful lavender purple colored one. Um, a blend of lavender, oak moss, and black pepper to invoke Celtic energy and transport you to the ancient isles. It's a 250 value. Um, the Celtic resin is a fourth ounce glass vial of cleansing resin you can burn on a charcoal disc or set on your altar in a bowl to prepare your space and it is a three dollar value oh this is a mini he's kind of breaking apart a little bit which usually happens with these um so a mini cedar bundle burn to cleanse your new Celtic altar and sacred space. And um, this has a $4 value. And then we've got the Celtic altar um, electric witch deck here, card expansion pack, which I've got quite a few. I'll show those in just a second. Um, we've got five cards, the Celtic Knots, Celtic Tree of Life, Cedar, Celtic Goddesses, and Celtic Gods to add to your Electric Witch card deck. And these have a $5 value. So, all together, cards here. And then the box, the cedar wand, necklace, altar claw, candle, resin, you know what I didn't see? Oh, did I? No, this was a $3 value. Um, I don't know if I skipped this. The Celtic Blessing Ritual Oil. A sample of our new blend to help cleanse and charge your new altar items. You can also add the oil to your aromatherapy necklace. And it's got a $3 value. So the oil... And the tile... You can see all these things. Don't forget this adorable bag. And that was everything that came in this month's box. Then, spoiler card for next month, which is one of my favorite things um, because then I can choose if I want to skip or if I want to get next month's box if it vibes with me. Um, so it says, thank you for your Ink Goddess Creations box purchase this month. Here is early access to next month's theme, Witchy Senses. Oh my gosh. I feel like this has the most perfect timing because I've been trying to get my third eye to open up a little bit more and to interpret my dreams a little bit better. Um, I'll explain that in, in my vlog. But, anywho, oh, um, I said I would show you the... This is how big my deck is so far. I'm going to add these to it. Sorry, that was Tucker trying to get to his bed under, under here. Um, but, these are all her her cards, and it just, if I can turn them around, keeps growing, and I'm so excited, and I love it because they aren't just, like, tarot cards. They're, like, informational cards. This was from a different box, but um, they give you a lot of detailed information about different things. So, 
go check out her store. It's awesome. And I hope everybody stays safe and healthy and all that other fun stuff. And good luck on all of your workings and everything to come. And if you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe below. And thank you for taking the time to watch this video and spending time with me. Blessed be.